going on? What do you have to, Chef Johnny? <laughs> I'm so delighted to see you today. Oh, you caught me. You caught me the best time. <laughs> Really? Yeah, I'm just in the middle of making some slippery, sloppy, freezy drinks. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. These are my specialties. It's a frozen latte caramel espressiano. No way. Yep. Well, what goes into such a thing? Well, first, first ingredient is here our mixing device, which is expensive. Secondly, well, I start first with, uh, 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 bananas, bananas, probably a product of Puerto Rican. Stick the banana in there, just one banana, you peel it, left, down the center, down the side. Take it in little sections, take it for a piece off, put it in the Nutra system. <laughs> it's not a Nutra system, there's no copyright on that. Stick the banana in that bander in there, and uh, then then you stick a bunch of ice cubes in there. Whether you want to do two or three or four or seven, uh, roughly, it's up to you. It depends on how much chilling you want to be, how much frothiness you want inside, deep inside. Then after that, I just top it with some chocolate milk, two percent, and then I put a little bit of cream. Remember? A little bit of cream, a little bit of cream, a cream. Stuck some of that in there and just uh, stuck on in the stair machine. Sweet cream, huh? A little regular cream. You know, like a uh, uh, half and a half. Mm. What, what kind of ice cream? Oh, there's ice cream in there. I forgot to tell you. It's uh. It's a espresso flavor ice cream. Ooh. Goes great with what we're doing. We're making a frozen ice smoothie latte coffee. Primo. Now, let me show you what kind of uh, cream we got on here. It's icy cream. I might have stuck it back in the refrigerator instead of the freezer. Oh, nope, here it is. Turkey Hill. Double chocolate. Caramel espresso limited edition. Ooh. Let me just tell where, you what they where, got going on in here. Where did you uh, get that from? Rent Warehouse Markets in Shenandoah, Pennsylvania, 462 on the Gold Star Highway, where you can get two boxes of ice cream for $5. That makes it $2.50 box. It, it's, it's espresso frozen dairy dessert with dark chocolate caramel truffles and a sea salted caramel swirl. <laughs> nice. Take your ice cream, put it back in the freezer. Back in the, back in the freezer. <laughs> you know what? Now you get all sloppy and sticky. <laughs> and I just uh, took my mixture, you see here. Ooh. 20 ounces max. I always go over that. You want to max it out, baby. You stay within the limits your whole life. You'll never see what's on the outside. Max it out. I put some honey in here, too. Look. Honey. Mm -hmm. Ingredients? Honey. <laughs> There's no artificial flavorings in there. That's straight from the bee's mouth. <laughs> So, I stuck all them ingredients in here, and uh... <laughs> And it's just frothy! Now, after that, unscrew your lid. So foamy, it's so delicious. Look how foamy and frothy that is. Do you see it? You see all those delicious bubbles speaking to you? They say. <laughs> it seems like bananas in glory. Hence, the kitchen of glory. 
So now that we've got our ingredients made, oh, the best part of this is it's got bubbles. Sticky little suction cups. <laughs> so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna get our cup. You can get any long cylinder with a long base if you want, so you have plenty of room for extra ingredients and coffee. Preferably grab two of them because you want to drink with a friend. You drink this alone, you're a loser. <laughs> you need a companion. <laughs> I've got my wiki. <laughs> my me. My Abzy Dabsy. Abzy Kadabsy. She prepared this here coffee for me. Just remember to send some money orders and payments to uh, Johnny's Kitchen at glory.edu.net.com.gov. Preferably a $50 money order. And we'll send you some of our delicious espresso caramel dark chocolate double espresso lattes. Crafted and engineered here in the Kitchen of Glory, Monte City, Pennsylvania. Rima. Taste. Remember. Now, what we're going to do, move our teapots aside. Don't forget about your cheese, ladies and gentlemen. It's good for your heart. It's good for the ticker. Take your hot coffee, because we you could use cold brewed coffee. That's where you get your caffeine, you see. They make cold brewed coffee so you can add some ice to it so that it stays cold and it stays strong. Because if you add hot coffee, it's gonna melt all your ingrediente. And therefore it's not gonna be so cold anymore because you added all this heat to it. But we got no choice, you see, it was the last second idea. <laughs> I had to run to my papa's house and grab my shredder system that I forgot I had in there for a very long time. So I'm gonna do it this way. I really don't know. I've never made these before. <laughs> Pour a little bit of that. Just a little bit to start out. Mm -hmm. Maybe about a third a cup. A third a cup. Because if you do half or a quarter or three quarters, just might be too much or too little. You just never know. You gotta try. Trial and error. That's how things are done in this here country. Trial and error. The cream of the crop. Way too tight. Cream of the crop. Now we're going to add some of our delicious ingrediente in here. Maybe I should do a little more coffee. Maybe I should do a little more coffee. It's not really an espresso latte if it doesn't have at least half percentages of coffee because if it's all delicious desserts then it's just going to be a dessert we want to get caffeinated we want to get a little crazy <laughs> uh chef johnny what else you make with that uh, uh shredding device the shredder, well, you can put in all kinds of fruits and vegetables. You can make yourself a tomato puree. You can make yourself a smoothie. Mm. You can make kale in there. You can put all kinds of vegetables and fruits in there together with mm. ice or milk. You can uh, shred turkey. You ever try shredding turkey on Thanksgiving? No. It's not easy. See, you got to go with the grain. If you go against the grain, forget it. You gotta take it. Here's your turkey breast. In the shape of a breast. Take one in. Shred it in staples in little strips. So that when you get the meat, you take the strip of turkey and go, ah. <laughs> Stick it on in there. But I see. So you can shred your turkey in your shredding device. Put cheese in there. You serve your very sprinkle cheese over some salsa and chips. <clears throat> Right there, that device will shred your cheese, whether it's Cooper Sharp or, or Extra Sharp or Vermont Wide or Swiss. Mm -hmm. It'll shred cheese. Wow. You can put all kinds of things in there. You can put a little bit of this, a little bit of that, whatever you decide, whatever you want to. Here in the Kitchen of Glory, in Chef Johnny's Kitchen of Glory, you can do anything. <laughs> now, watch. Delicious, frothy, smooth, velvety elegance. Well, do that. I guess we're gonna grab a spoon and mix it. Just like you done there, mix your teas and things like that. 
stir the same way, the same situation. We want to mix these. Uh, we want to mix these here uh, ingredients the right way. Now we're going to add some ice because, like I said, when it's hot and cold, it gets warm. It's still warm. It wants to be cold, chilled. Get some ice from your refrigerator. Take a couple cubes. Look, this one's going to handle. It's going to handle. Put <laughs> them in there. Convenient. So convenient. Or maybe these ice cubes did a real good job. Handles on. Now my guess is here in the kitchen of glory, these ice cubes are about three or four years old. <laughs> Pretty old ice cubes. But ice doesn't go bad, does it? <laughs> does water go bad? Mm. Not when it's stewy. Not when it's under 32 degrees Fahrenheit. I don't think it does. So, anyways, we're going to stick our ice back in here in the freezer so that it uh, doesn't melt on us like it did down here on the floor. Drop a few pieces. Anyways, you take your sippy cup with your ice and your ingredients and your coffee and you. Later. I can taste the coffee. I can taste the bananas. I can even taste the ice. Here at Johnny's Kitchen of Glory, you can get some of these tasted. Get your sip on.